Hey everybody, welcome to Toy Wizards for another spontaneous toy review. My name is Scott Zillner and I love toys. Let's take a look at today's toy and that is the brand new 6 inch Spartan figure that I've been seeing at stores and all I can think of is Dude, this guy's G.I. Joe is scaled. This is a new company making these toys now, uh, WCT. We've seen a lot of companies make figures over the years, and this is my first time opening one of this new series. I'm gonna go ahead and open it from the back. I've been doing that with a lot of these box toys now because there's only one piece of tape. It makes it easy, real easy. And there we go. Let's take a look. I've been a big Halo fan. I even had an original Xbox to play the game on it. And I've never finished Halo 1. I like Halo 2 a lot more. Um, so I, I played Halo 2 and the Halo 1, I just never finished it. I got stuck on some point crossing a bridge and I didn't have enough ammo to beat the bad guys. And I was like, well, screw it, done. Never finished it. There are some twist ties and there is a good plethora of hands here. He's got a lot of different hands you can place in there, so that's kind of neat. Try to get this twist tie out, and we can pull John Spartan out and uh, see how it goes. That was a Demolition Man reference, if you guys didn't catch it. All right. You're free, buddy. Maybe. Oh. Apparently, there was some twist ties on his feet I didn't see, and those maybe broke them out. <laughs> uh, first thing... It's pretty solid in your hand. This is a good, big, thick figure. I like that. I'm checking out some of the, how the articulation works and I think I might have already broken an arm. Yeah, yeah, something broke. Going to break? I think I just have it at the wrong angle. Yeah, so that uh, shoulder joint is a little sticky. I can't seem to move the other one enough to bend it down and now twist. Okay, yeah, I, I, I totally fractured his arm right off the box. Oh man, that's not good. <laughs> not good. Now the other arm seems to be working better. So maybe that one just got a little stuck, but uh, let's take a look at the rest of his articulation. He's got one gummy arm now. It's literally just hanging on by a thread. I like his feet articulation. That's nice. Knees, again, it's a solid figure. I just must have twisted that top arm just the wrong way. I do like the metallic visor, like they actually threw in some chrome plating, which is rare these days for figures. I like that too. Gun, Let's see if that gun fits in his hand. Can you fit that gun in his hand? There we go. Gun looks a little small, but maybe it's based on a newer game. I'm kind of used to the larger guns that we got with the other figures. And there we go. John Spartan's ready for battle. Needs to see a medic. But uh, it's a pretty nice figure. What do you think? Go fight the flood? What is this place? Now, in the same point that since this is a six inch figure, you can definitely, you know, go ahead and have him with your GI Joes. He is a bit taller than a Joe, so it makes him about a seven inch figure rather than six inch figures. And we're like, this is my bodyguard gonna walk me in with my case full of money or just the same you can bring in your marvel legends you tried you to kill me fight marvel legends this figure works good with the rest of your six inch scaled figures maybe even your uh, dc universe figures since they're seven inches i just like the size of the figure um i think it plays really well with my gi joe collection and that's where it's gonna go i mean just to be, to be safe um, let's see how well these hands pop off. Better than the arm popping off. That comes out. New hand goes in. It has six extra hands. No problem. No problem there. That's easy. Let's see if I can get the other hand back on. Yes. He had a handgun. Let's see if that handgun fits in his hand. This one only came with two weapons. There's several different figures in this scale. There is a red one that is uh, exclusive just for Target stores. So if you want that Target red one, you have to go to Target. You know, that's just how those things work. A little hard getting the pistol into his hand. Maybe this hand is just made for 
the uh, rifle. Yeah, that will need a, a hair dryer to get the pistol in. Uh, there is a small little thing on his back where you can attach a weapon, which is nice. Stick that on there. I like that. No grenades. I guess he'll have to pick up some grenades out there when he's fighting. And I didn't see any bad guys in this scale yet either. I did see a lot of the other four inch scale, which we do have a uh, Warthog to review with our GI Joe in the four inch scale for size as well. So that will be another video. Check back for that one later. All in all, this is a great figure. I wish I didn't break the arm on it. Monkey hands, what can I say? I do like the thickness of it. I do like the scale. The articulation is nice. The chrome visor really sells it for me on that bit. And it's just, it's sculpted really well. I've, I'm one of the guys that actually working on Halo for different companies, I have written out the little spreadsheets on like, this should be this color, that should be that color, this should be this color. I've written those sheets out for companies. So I do like the uh, color palette they've chosen. I like the armor they've chosen, the suit. You know, obviously this is just two colors. I would have, you know, made certain things different colors if I had the color choices available. They kept this pretty slim. Um, it does have some metal weathering on it. A little, a tad too much, but then again, it looks like you've just crashed him into the planet, got up and started fighting, and that's what he does. Those Covenant will not stop unless we stop them. There we go. Uh, Halo is available on your Xbox consoles, and if you haven't played it before, I recommend picking up Halo 2. Yeah, Halo 2 is great. There's some Halo 3 stuff that's not bad, too. Really, really good stuff. Halo 4, just didn't care for it. I don't know, just didn't like it. No, sir, didn't like it. All right, John, any words of wisdom? Bye. Do you feel lucky, punk? All right, everybody, thank you so much for paying attention to this obscure Halo review um, and watching me mangle yet another action figure with my giant man hands. Monkey hands. With my giant monkey hands. Sorry about that. Hey everyone, please like, subscribe, follow us, and you know, give us cookies, all that kind of good stuff, and we will catch you later. Yeah, 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 yeah.